Hey guys, it's Ken from KBD Productions TV. Welcome back to another Kendomic Food Review just for you. I am in sunny Orlando, Florida at Playlist Live, but it's breakfast time, so I thought I'd come over to Frankie Farrell's, which is right across from my hotel, and do an all day breakfast called Irish Breakfast, and it's got a whole ton of cool things on the plate. Let's go in, order it, and review it just for you. Let's go. All right, guys, my breakfast has arrived. I got my orange juice. I've got all my condiments. She brought it out for me. Excellent, and my breakfast looks absolutely fantastic. Let's go in for a close-up, shall we? All right, guys, here's the extreme close-up of the Irish breakfast. I went for sunny side. She asked me how I wanted my eggs, and I went sunny side. She put the butter on top to help melt it for my toast. Got four pieces of perfectly cooked toast. We've got baked beans. We've got tomatoes. I thought they were going to be uh, fried tomatoes, but it doesn't look like it. Uh, and then we've got three meats here. We've got black pudding, white pudding, sausage, and bacon. If there are any Irish followers, viewers, fans of KBD Productions TV, what do you call the bacon? Okay, guys, let's get right into this. I'm going to... I'm not sure if I should watch what I'm supposed to do. Am I supposed to like mix it all up? Yeah, the butter's all nice and soft now because they put it on the hot eggs. Uh, one of the things I like on my eggs is um, pepper. And these are self-grinding. Well, not self-grinding. You have to do it yourself. But it's kind of neat. Look at that. Twist. I'm not going to put any ketchup on this. That's, I think, sacrilege. So I'm going to move my... i got to move my plate around here somehow. Okay. I'll push that off to the side. Oh boy, this looks amazing. So I, I'm a kind of guy who likes mixing everything together, but I definitely want to make sure I get... I wish there was more black pudding. Here's a close-up of that bacon. Again, Irish friends, let us know in the comments below what that's called, because it's not called bacon. Well, it is bacon, but you guys call it something different. Mmm. It tastes like fried ham, but on the greasier side of bacon. That's what that tastes like. Let's give the sausage a try, all by itself. Not bad. Let's try, please. Oh, I'm I'm, wait, I'm doing black pudding last. This is a white sausage. Wow, completely different than the sauce. It's like way different. Has a lot of spices in it. I'm trying to figure out what spices it is. I'm not really good at it. It's very garlicky and onion. Onion and garlic. That's what that tastes like, the white sausage. Again, if you know what white sausage is made out of, leave it in the comments below. And we're going to do black pudding last here. Black pudding is basically blood in sausage and that's what makes it black and then you fry it up in little rings like this used to eat all the time as a kid one of my dad's favorites it's been a long long time since I've had it so black pudding all by itself isn't the most flavorful well it is flavorful, but it's not the kind of thing you eat all by itself. You gotta mix it with other stuff. So let's get right into this. Let's get crazy. We're gonna cut up our eggs. And then we're gonna mix some stuff together just to make it perfect the way I like it. Let's cut up that black sausage. Nice. White sausage. It's like cutting up a pizza. The little sausages. We'll cut up this bacon. The bacon is amazing, by the way. I gotta find out where I can get this from home. That's how good it is. We'll cut up some of the sausage. All right, it's all cut up. That took a while. Uh, I'm gonna get some egg, some black sausage. Put the egg back on before I. There we go. Got a little hanger happening. 
We got black sausage, sausage, egg, white, white sausage. Jeez, this is gonna be a mouthful. Let's try to get do it this way. There, oh, come on. This isn't the easiest thing to do. I just wanna have like one mouthful with everything in it. Ooh la la. And a piece of tomato. Let's try that. Here we go. Fit for a king. Mmm. Wow. Each one of those things all by itself was okay. When I mixed every single one of those ingredients on my plate into one mouthful, uh, one huge forkful in my mouth, it was absolutely fantastic. All right, guys, let's try this orange juice. I'm not sure there's a little floater in it. Don't know what that was, but we'll take that out. I am sitting outside, so something might have fallen in. The orange juice isn't very good. I wouldn't recommend ever drinking that orange juice at this location, but the breakfast itself, this Irish breakfast is fantastic. Maybe next time I'll do a Guinness with it since it's an Irish breakfast. All right, guys, I'm gonna polish this off just for you, so hang on. Still lots to go. Well, there you go, ladies and gentlemen, two points for Ken. All right, guys, on my rating scale, I'm gonna give, as you can probably can tell, the orange juice I would not recommend, but the Irish breakfast here at Farrell's in Orlando, Florida, is a go out and get it now. If you're staying at Lake Buena Vista Village Spa, uh, walk across the street, head up Frankie's, and have the Irish breakfast. It was absolutely fantastic huge thumbs up to you guys. All right, guys, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Ding, 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 ding. And we'll see you next time on another Ken Domic food review. Ken Domic out. Boop. I am in sunny Orlando, Florida at this place. Frankie Farrell's. At Frankie Farrell's Irish Pub and Grill. Irish breakfast. And it has a whole bunch of cool things on the plate itself. That's dumb. My breakfast has arrived, as you can see. <clears throat> Let's start that again. Oh, I need to bend it down a little bit. Can I see this? Yes. Okay, guys, here's your extreme close-up of my breakfast. Nope. Uh, and then we've got bacon on the bottom. If any of my Irish folk friends are into... That would sound really stupid. All right, guys, as you can see, my breakfast has arrived. We got toast, eggs, sausages, and stuff. Yeah.